Welcome to the 2016-2017 course selection process for students entering grade 11. For the first time in your school career, you will have a significant amount of choice in the classes that you can select. If you have already completed your course selection sheet prior to today, just follow along to ensure that your choices are accurate. All students who haven't completed their sheet or who did not bring in their completed form will be choosing their courses today. Once you are all done your selections, you will hand in your completed form to your homeroom teacher. At a later date, you will receive a verification form listing your selections for next year. That form will need to be signed by a parent or guardian and returned to the school. Let's begin with the mandatory courses that you must select. Please look at the top of the list of courses on the left side of your selection sheet. All students entering grade 11 must select a grade 11 English class. There are three options for you to choose from in grade 11 English. You can select English 11-1 if you have a great interest in English, would like to be challenged, and if you generally score well in this subject. It is recommended that you have a mark of 85% or higher in grade 10 English in order to select English 11-1. Both English 11-1 and 11-2 are acceptable for those seeking admission to university. Most students will select English 11-2. The third option is English 11-3. This course is recommended for students who find English courses difficult and may need more time to complete assignments and classroom work. Some college programs accept this level of English, but universities definitely will not. Colleges generally accept an English 11-3 credit. If you're not sure, have a discussion with your current English teacher prior to submitting your verification sheet. Please select a grade 11 English course now by placing an X in the box on the left-hand side of the course you are selecting. It is now time to consider your math class or classes for next year. All students in New Brunswick must pass a minimum of one grade 11 math class. Students must select one of the following two courses, Financial and Workplace Math 11 or Foundations of Mathematics 11. Financial and Workplace Math 11 can be used towards some college programs or arts degrees at university, depending on the university and usually in liberal arts programs. Students who find math difficult or students who are not pursuing a post-secondary education in a math or science field or certain business programs may benefit from choosing this option. Foundations of Mathematics 11 can be used towards some college programs and some university programs. It is a prerequisite for any pre-calculus course which is required for any university program such as science, engineering, and possibly business. Students who enjoy math or plan on pursuing one of these fields after high school should take this course. If you are a grade 10 student who is currently taking the Foundations of Mathematics 11 course, you will leave this section blank. All other students, please select a grade 11 math course now. You will have an opportunity to choose additional math courses when you select your electives a little later. Take notice of the Math Pathways section at the bottom of the course selection worksheet. It suggests your course options for you depending on what kind of math courses you want on your academic transcripts when you graduate. Please select a Grade 11 Mathematics course now by placing an X in the box on the left-hand side of the course you are selecting. You must now choose your mandatory history course. If you have already passed Modern History 11 or are currently taking this course, then you can skip this section. For all other students, your options for Modern History are Modern History 11-2, Modern History 11-3, 
French Immersion Modern History 11-2. Please select one of these options now by placing an X in the box on the left-hand side of the course you are selecting. Now let's look at the science options. In order to graduate from a New Brunswick high school, students must have a minimum of one science at the grade 11 or 12 level. If you are quite interested in science and or are considering a science degree in university, you will want to choose chemistry and at least one other grade 11 science class. It is recommended that those interested in sciences take all the grade 11 science classes they want first, such as chemistry 11, biology 11, physics 11, and wait until grade 12 to take the grade 12 version of these courses. Please choose at least one science course from the list by placing an X in the box on the left hand side of the course you are selecting. Fine Arts Life Role Development In New Brunswick all high school students must pass one Fine Arts or Life Role Development course in order to graduate. Please check one of the Fine Arts Life Roll course options by placing an X in the box on the left-hand side of the course you are selecting. Now that you have selected all of the mandatory requirements for graduation, it is time to move on to the electives. This is where you have some more choice. You are to choose as many courses as you need so that you have an opportunity to get 10 total credits next year. Keep in mind that if you are a French Immersion student, you must take five of your electives courses in French over the course of your grade 11 and your grade 12. If you do not pick five Immersion courses, this means that you are leaving French Immersion program. In this case, you must meet your guidance counselor to discuss the transfer process before selecting your courses. Remember, out of 17 credits, which is the minimum total for graduation, students can only have a total of two local option courses on their academic transcript. If a student obtains more than 17 credits, they may have additional local option course. When choosing your courses, be aware of what local option courses are and what that means for your graduation eligibility. These local options are listed in a separate section below the other elective courses. Remember, grade 11 English is worth two credits, so you need your grade 11 English courses plus eight other courses. If you didn't pass the English language proficiency assessment that you wrote in grade nine and didn't write the ELPA because you were out of province, it is highly recommended that you take Learning Strats 12-0, which will help you prepare for this graduation requirement assessment. Take some time to choose some courses now. When you're finished, please remember to give your worksheet back to your homeroom teacher. And don't worry, you'll have a verification sheet of the courses you've picked and that you'll have to sign off on before they're actually entered into the system.